uh, good morning again, um, fellow programmers, C Sharp programmers, students. Um, I'm here again to continue my tutorial about control that beep. So previously we learned about how to play Doremi Paso Latito. If you're not yet uh, aware of that, please watch my previous video. So here, uh, as you can see, uh, I retained the codes for Doremi Paso Latito. So for each note, uh, there is a corresponding uh, set of tones from lowest to highest tones. So it just uh, covering four octaves. Uh, so uh, we will be using that. Maybe uh, the, the, the third octave. So uh, let us start. Um, actually, I created the piano already. So what are we going to do is to explain it one by one so that you know how to uh, code a piano. So it's really easy. So we just uh, use a while loop here. Uh, before that, uh, character key and uh, the initial value is 1. So it doesn't matter. Uh, we will be, uh, it's just uh, an initial value. And then um, in this loop, while I am not pressing escape, uh, the piano will still be running. And it's still uh, waiting for the user to press any key. So um, within this loop, we, we use the console.read key. And there is a parameter true. It means that we have to, uh, to hide the character. Oh, it, uh, we will not be displaying the character if we specify true uh, in the parameter of read key. And then we will be getting the key character here because the the data type of key is character. So that's it. And then um, we will be using set cursor position because we will be displaying the note that we will be pressing later. And then um, we also use the console foreground color. So you can colorize your, col uh, your characters here. And then uh, we use switch. So this is a conditional block where uh, we are evaluating each keys that we are that we will be pressing. So um, I assign Q W E R T Y U N I. So uh, for each note, so we have do re mi fa so la ti do. So up we will be beeping each um, notes. So I, I'm using that third octave because uh, while two because uh, an array is um, starting from zero element. So its index would be uh, starting from zero. So zero, one. This is zero, this is one, two, three. So it's different from the from the old programming uh, language like Pascal. It is starting from one. So here I will be st it's starting from zero. So this that's additional info for uh, an array if you're not yet uh, aware of an array. So that's it. As you can see, I'll be posting this in the comment section so that you can evaluate. And you can beautify your piano, but uh, because it is pretty basic and uh, really uh, easy to learn. So uh, let's play it now. So I'm going to play "Love Is All That Matter" for piano. So that's it. That is uh, how I play the piano. First tone. 
I'm not a musician, but uh, I know how to uh, play sounds. I am uh, like thinking the next tune after I press a tune, right? So that's it. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope that uh, th this would be an additional uh, information that you will be learn. And uh, I hope that uh, on my future video, uh, I can uh, teach again a different um, way or different um, things that might uh, be valued when you are uh, on, on uh, progressing your programming um, cap uh, uh, programming skills or programming hobby. So um, thank you so much. Please subscribe my channel if you want. <laughs> thank you.